All right, we're at the Wells Fargo Championship. This is where I was last year, over here at the Pudding Green. When I threw a business card to Tiger Woods. He ignored it. I told him I wanted him to train his replacement, Tiger Jr. Now he won't be here 2019. They say in 2020 that the PJ is coming to Charlotte, so we, I guess we'll see him then. He'll be 44 by then. It's a fact that Tiger Jr., Tiger Woods in the fourth quarter, he won't be playing a whole lot of tournaments. So he may not be coming to Charlotte for a while after next year, PJ championship tour but I got his replacement and I'm not gonna stop to the whole world sees and know what I know that Tiger Jr. is the future of golf we gotta have kids we have somebody to look up to and our motto is absence it's okay it's okay it's not worth it kids need somebody to look up to so they won't ruin their life with drugs sex Illegitimate children, abortions. If Tiger Jr. can 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 do it, they'll have somebody to look up to. Tiger Woods talked high, but he lived low. We need somebody that's real. All right, this is the five-star general at Quail Hollows, owned by Johnny Harris, Wells Fargo Championship. I've seen Johnny Vegas. I haven't seen Webb Simpson yet. Met him yesterday. And it's about three o'clock and it's getting awful hot here. They got all kind of gadgets and stuff. So I think this is about all the golf that I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get back on the Forest Hill shuttle bus, go to the library of Revolution Golf Course and write this whole thing up. Put it on YouTube and Facebook. Who knows, maybe I'll get it Sunday if somebody can get me a ticket. All right, this is the general, Tiger. Junior is the future of golf. He's got a Facebook page for asking for donations. We met Webb Simpson yesterday at Revolution. I gave him a business card and uh, said he'll take a look at it. That's all I can do is faith and works.